July 2008, operator BG Group with partners discovered hydrocarbons in the Kanar field in the North Sea. By 2011, several providers compete for the tender, but it is TK that is successful and is awarded the contract for the Petrial Kanar FPSO. From 2011 and up towards 2014, the 256 meters long, 48 meters wide vessel takes shape. Petrial Kanar will be able to produce 63,000 barrels of oil per day and have the storage capacity of more than 800,000 barrels of oil. The internal turret and swivel system is the heart of the Petrial Kanar. This advanced piece of engineering allows the vessel to freely rotate 360 degrees. This ensures that Petrial Kanar always will be facing the rough weather present in the North Sea. Two azimuth thrusters are installed aft to assist if needed for the heading control. Twelve mooring lines keep Petrial Kanar geostationary and a total of six risers are installed for stable and efficient production. Another key aspect has been to reduce the environmental footprint of the FPSO. Produced water will, under normal circumstances, be re-injected into the reservoir, eliminating discharge of oil to sea. State-of-the-art waste heat recovery units is fitted to optimize the vessel's energy efficiency. A closed flaring and cargo blanketing system eliminate emissions from flaring during normal operations. The field is estimated to contain some 44 million recoverable barrels of oil and will produce from 6 to 20 years. Most likely, however, Petrial Kanar will have many good years of operation after leaving the Kanar field.